When I'm tying a bowline, I start with a fairly short piece of running end, about eight inches. I create a loop where the rope or the line crosses over itself. I bring a bite up through that loop to create the beginnings of an overhand slip. I'm going to go with the running end through that bite that I created. Give myself a little bit of a tail. And then I'm going to take the end again and fold it back on itself. And then I'm going to pinch where I folded that over onto itself and I can let go of the rest. Now when I pull on the standing end to dress that knot up, my bowline is going to form.